Okay, so today at Auto Sparks, we've got something a little bit different to play with. We've got a uh, 2018 Tesla Model S to put uh, Thinkware front and rear witness cameras in and uh, a vehicle security system including alarm immobiliser um, all working off the Tesla remote control um, but with the added benefit of driver recognition so the system will arm and disarm using the uh, Tesla remote but it will only disarm if our driver card is present at the same time a little driver card that the driver keeps on his person now when we um, typically when we lock the vehicle with a push of the remote control you get a beep there from the siren uh, battery backup sign which is under the bonnet it's a bit difficult to see in the sunlight but there is a little blue flashing LED just over on the uh, passenger side O post over there let's have a see if we can pan round and have a look at that um, no it's very difficult to see in the sunlight but there you go that's a little blue flashing LED to let people know there's aftermarket security on the vehicle um, now what happens is let's uh, let's assume that the um, the key here is a, a cloned key stolen key um, and uh, the thief is uh, going to attempt to steal the car. So it would press the, uh, the button, as this one's programmed for button push. Door handles come out, we can now get in the vehicle. Now, once we're in the vehicle, um, these are the driver cards that the system's looking for. They're both switched off at the moment, so there's no signal being presented from those driver's cards. Now, down in here, if we can get down there, is a um, little red flashing light there. That is flashing fast to tell, tell me that the system is looking for the driver card. If it can't see it within 25 seconds, um, it will trigger the alarm. The immobiliser is also active. There we go, there's the alarm triggered. Now, if I attempt to start the car with this particular model, foot on the brake, uh, and as you'll see, we're getting no ignition coming on. Um, unlock required. So, if I attempt to unlock using the Tesla remote control, which was a double push, nothing at all. So it's not going to disarm. After 30 seconds of the siren sounding, it will um, pause shortly before it re-triggers. So I'll just let that uh, time out. There we go. Now, just to show you, if I turn a driver card on, which is one of these little cards here, which stays with the driver. There you go, it's seen me moving about again. If I turn that card on, you'll see the alarm disarms. Our ignition is on. And we're ready to go. There you go, D for drive. Back to park again. So all the time the alarm is sounding, and even if it's not sounding, when our system is armed, the, uh, the vehicle is immobilised, so it's got additional immobilisation on it. Now, now the driver card, this little card, is switched on. If that's just in our vicinity, uh, and I press the, uh, the lock button on the Tesla remote control, oh, which it won't let me do while I'm in the car, so let me jump out of the car. I'll take the card with me. So here we go. So we're going to press the uh, the lock button on the Tesla remote control. There we go. Our system arms. You hear the beep there. Um, difficult to see. Sun, sunny day today. But the LED up on the post there is flashing away. Just to give visual warning that there's um, an aftermarket security system on there. Um, now, what we'll do is we'll wait for the uh, system to fully arm, which is typically about 20 seconds or so. Um, uh, I can't show you from there because of the sun, but when our little red light is flashing static, a uh, uh, sort of uh, steady flash, then we know our system's armed. So we're armed at the moment. So I'm going to disarm the system. Remember, our driver card is switched on now. So I'll press the Tesla remote to disarm the system. With, with on this one, it's a double push. So we'll double push. And as you heard there, our alarm and immobiliser beep. Switched off straight away. Vehicle's ready to drive. Jump in. And there you go drive okay so there you go additional security on the uh, model s tesla 2018 model um apparently this vehicle's on the uh, on the hit list at the moment for stolen uh, being stolen with a clone or stolen key so um worth considering some uh, additional security give us a call if you uh, if you need to find out more there's our contact number there 0330 010 or track us down on our socials and uh, we'll be happy to uh, find a solution for your vehicle model tesla model s or uh, or otherwise okay thanks for watching